Take a break from your day to join us for some cake. Leftovers celebrating one of my kids. Before we get cracking on this video, remember I said if we get over 100 comments on last video, which we did, we would do a little prize contest thing. So that's, that's what we're gonna do real quick. And we're gonna do this from now on. Every time a video gets 100 comments before the next video comes out, then we'll do a giveaway. And for now we'll do 100, but it seems like you guys are gonna hit that real easily. So don't be surprised if we bump the numbers up in the future. But yes, yeah, that's part of always getting better. So I was just testing it out and I went ahead and already did it on, on my test to run proved to work. So <laughs> next time I'll make sure to click the buttons on screen on camera while you guys are watching so you can see the little process. It's pretty simple though. I just put the uh, URL for the video right in here. Hit search and it said we had 115 unique commenters. Even if you leave 17 comments, you're only gonna get one spot to draw. You know what I mean? You get that? Makes sense? Of course it does. And today is Katie Stacy, and her comment is, you are a breath of fresh air on this overcast gray day in London, England. Smiley face. I love that your boys are all mud, dirt, bugs and all. Eli reminds me of my youngest son. He likes everything snake even cleaning them and doing their waters heart. Thanks, Katie. Go ahead and get a hold of me in one of the many ways that there are to get a hold of me in my description. Every one of my videos is in my description. There's always ways to get a hold of me. Hit me up. Congratulations. P.S. Today's video also has the sunset winner announced, and I even did a short little music video about it, so you might want to check that out. Top of the morning, friends and family. How you beautiful people doing out there today? We are adventuring. Check out this crazy kid back here. What the heck is that guy doing? He's just adventuring, man. We're on an adventure. Man, you guys would not believe where we're at, and you're not gonna believe how we got here either. Oh, I busted my speed bag already. Luckily, I have this gift card that I got for Christmas from my in-laws to Dick's, which is a sporting goods store around here. I'm pretty sure I should be able to find a new speed bag to replace it at Dick's. And of course, since I'm going over there, there's a Target nearby and Hillary added to my list of things to get. Uh, so we're gonna do a little shopping trip with the boys and daddy and we're going to Target, we're going to Dick's. We're gonna get stuff. You guys ready for this exciting shopping adventure? Yeah. You see it at the same time, it means you mean it, right? You guys mean it? Uh-huh. Okay, uh -huh. so you must not have meant that one because that wasn't at the same time. What? Anyway guys, shopping extravaganza, here we go. Dicks, where champions shop. Didn't bring my camera into the magical place known as Target because every time I bring my camera inside one of these stores, I always seem to get flagged. Excuse me sir, you can't be filming here so I don't even try anymore. Airplane! Airplane? Yeah, I'm coming! But the thing I did remember about this place is that right behind this Target store here, there's this awesome creek zone down there. Boys are here, got their nets, we're gonna check it out. You're in the middle? No, I am. Just a shopping trip that turned into an adventure behind the store. I think these guys are digging it. We're having a good time. You know, we got a lot of rain recently, so this creek is filling up. There was this crazy guy in the bushes back there that was 
spewing some crazy stuff out of the from out of the bushes. <laughs> we just ignored him for the most part, but man, if that guy comes flying out of the bushes at some point, uh, he better be coming with peace. Hey Eli, what do you know? This water. This water? Yeah. What about this water? Um, because this water has poop in it. <laughs> this water has poop in it? Yeah. Well, you better not fall in then. No making, no making bridge for me I can climb up way up there. No, it's actually for me to get more flowers for mommy. Hey Noah, what do you know? I know. What about flowers? That they are beautiful and girls like flowers and that's all I know. So I do the same thing I do every time or no. Do whatever you want to do, bud. Okay. I don't really know about flowers. I did not bring the controller for the drone. It is charging at home. I was really looking forward to flying it up this dirty, muddy creek. Noah's trying to build a bridge. It's been taking all day. And me trying to build a bridge. I've been taking all day. But I guess I'll just have to like throw the camera around to pretend it's the drone. Here we go. That's my fake drone flying with the camera. Oh, Eli, you're getting crazy. I'm just holding that. Eli's trying to follow Big Brother's footsteps. You want a hand down, bud? Yeah. Want help down? Yeah. Give me your hands. I got you. Go ahead, I'm not gonna let you fall. <laughs> kind of tough to climb up there, huh? That's kind of for big boys. Why? Right, you'll be able to do that. What? You'll get there, don't worry. I think Noah has found his happy place. I almost completely forgot we are supposed to be doing the sunset drawing. Okay, well, let's go home. Uh, it's time to get some sunset action on, guys. Let's do this, right? Okay, so there was only 15 people. I read off the list before. Nobody contacted me saying I messed up and didn't put them on the list when they're supposed to be, so I think I got it straight. Let's go ahead and pick. It's time to go, guys. It's time to go. If you didn't contact me and you were supposed to be on the list, man, you're sleeping. You're sleeping. These folks been on the list for a while. Numbers 1 through 15, click the randomizer button three times, and the third time we press it, whatever number comes up on that there, you're the winner. And congratulations in advance. Still got 76 up from the Freedom Bridge thing. Put it in 15. And here's click number one. 12, click number two, two, click number three, eight. Ooh, eight is a good number. Eight is actually one of my most absolute favorite numbers, so that's a good one. Let's go ahead and count down the list to see who number eight was. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mr. Chris Searcy. All right, Chris, you're the winner, man. Congratulations, dude. I will, I know how to get a hold of you if you don't get a hold of me right after the video, and we will get that Pos Het sunset out to you as soon as we can. What do you guys think about some music videos? Would you, would you guys be interested in seeing me do some crazy snake music video stuff? It sounds like fun. It's something I've kind of wanted to do for a little while. Just, you know, unleash my creativity on the world in the form of insane music videos and the lyrics I usually write you know what I'm gonna I'm gonna write some lyrics right now put it to music and I'll see you guys think I'm gonna do it right now it's a snake and you know it isn't fake always looks like he's awake cuz he doesn't have no eyelids Take a break from your day to join us for some cake Leftover celebrating one of my kids Mr. Cersei won this pass head sunset Ball Python's 101, we haven't fun yet Six months contest and it's over now Celebrating with some music, yeah, we showing you how We kick back, lay back, stay back, never whack One pack, cheese and mac, back crack, snap back, steel rack Attack, my neck, my back Ha <laughs> ha, we taking over in this biscuit <laughs> Oh man, oh that was fun. <laughs>
What do you guys? What do you guys think? Oh my God. Okay, as I was as I was doing that, and I was using this calendar as a prop for the uh, the video to you know show that the contest is over now, and I've got the Morelia Python's radio calendar here that I got from Eric. I was trying to go to March, and look here we got we got February here, right? And then <laughs> next page, <laughs> new picture, but February 2018. <laughs> Eric, if you're watching this, bro, you guys left March out of your calendar. Three fifths of my family was born in March, bro. We need March. All right, y'all, so that's what's up. <laughs> Music video extravaganza. You guys like that? You guys enjoy that? When I'm writing lyrical stuff, it always comes out in a rap form. I could start doing some country stuff too and some rock and roll stuff, but, and I could even turn that song into a country rock song, believe it or not. It's just the rap thing, it's just like, it's that poetry stuff. It just comes off well with rap for some reason, I think. But I still got all my coins. Money, 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 money everywhere. But here's what's going on right now. It is a beautiful day out here. It, I mean, it has been a beautiful day for the last couple days now. Look at that sky. And since we've been getting a ton of rain, a ton of rain, I bet you my favorite spot, my favorite lookout spot is gonna be beautiful green, something and I'll take you guys up there and show you just how beautiful I think it is. Especially we got all these white puffy clouds in the sky. I'm gonna go up to that vista point and fly the drone, get you guys some nice footage with some nice music. Sound nice? Let's go. Well dang, there ain't a cloud in the sky on this side. I'm hiding back over the hill over back of where I came from. This is the spot where I used to come all the time on my way to working with my uncle. This is like the halfway point and I would just stop off here in the morning and just kind of take in the view, appreciate the good things in life. Take a moment to reflect as I do from time to time. Even though there's no clouds, there sure is greenery. We got plenty of greenery down here. Don't fall off the mountain, Brian. Just wanna soak in that green before it leaves because our, our winter was not nearly as rainy as last winter, so we just gotta soak it up. Let's get that drone in the air, man. Well, that was fantastic. Let's go talk to Hillary. <laughs> Stomp your feet, everybody. It's me on the block. Stomp your feet, everybody. Cause that's me doing the talk. Mm -hmm. So. <laughs> and what else you gotta say about it? Oh, really? And how many times did that happen? I, I don't recognize that as a number. <laughs> Do you need a smooch? Well, she was fine while daddy had her for the last 15, 20 minutes. Apparently, mommy's not allowed to hold her without giving a little boob off. <laughs> so, Hillary. There you go. We haven't seen you for a while. What's been going on? <laughs> You're looking at it. Um, yeah. You guys saw the, <laughs> you guys saw me up close and personal. All the comments that we received are just like super heartfelt and 
really appreciate it because it was a very vulnerable thing to share. But I think that sharing things like that is what connects us and makes us all feel human and unfiltered and it's real. And I think we need more of that. So I wanted to share that and I'm glad we did, even though it was me and some of my most vulnerable moments. <laughs> but you guys were super encouraging and thank you for that. And she's here. And I feel like me again. I've been pregnant for so long. So it feels good to uh, get back to, you know, being me. Without a human growing inside me. Are you human? <laughs> Are you human growth? <laughs> That's why you don't like to be called a human growth? No? Okay. I know you're ready to eat, eat, eat. I think baby ready for some boo-boo. <laughs> hey, who's hiding back there? Noah Sage? <laughs> no, we're not getting naked scrimmings in on this one. I have to do a bunch of blurring. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 this is the moment when I don't have a lot to do <laughs> as far as the baby's concerned. Sing some silly songs in her face and smooch her face a lot and that's about it for me, you know what I mean? I, yeah, it's like I don't... You've been... I've been what? Super helpful just with, like, I just need help with these guys pretty much and like little things. I mean, brushing their teeth, which I mean they're becoming a lot more independent, I think, through this process, which is good for them. Yeah, there's not much you can do with the baby, but by helping out around the house yeah, I'm and helpful. with the boys, um, that is what I need, you know. I can take care of her, but trying to take care of her and zip up jackets and put on shoes and smush faces <laughs> with one hand <laughs> proves itself to be a little challenging. One hand. So. Yeah. Let's not talk about what's really crazy here. What's really crazy is that I moved this whole couch just so we could sit by my favorite window for the end of the vlog. And Noah, you still got a bunch of stuff you got to pick up from under the couch? Mm -mm. Uh, excuse me? You're a sizzle, Daddy. I'm a sizzle? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a sizzle. Don't you forget it. All right, Garrett. This one's for you, dude. I don't know who's sicker. You for wanting it to happen or me for doing it? Disgusting! God, you guys are sick.